Hello friends, in this video I will show you how to create a simple navigation drawer in Sketchware. So let's start. First, in order to create a navigation drawer, you have to go to library manager and switch on app compact and design. After that, we have to go to view manager, then click on main.xml for the activity in which you want to add the drawer then select this third option which is navigation drawer activity and click ok after that when you go back you will find this floating action button plus the navigation drawer is also implemented here you can see the drawer layout now whatever you want to show in the drawer layout you can add here so here i will be adding a linear one with width match parent and inside this I will add three text views now on clicking these text views I want to open three different activities so I will just rename them as page one Then this second one, I will rename it as page 2. And this third one, I will rename this as page 3. Now after this, I will create three different custom views, sorry, three different activities. The first one, page one, second one, page two, and third one, page three. And after this, I will set the set some color in each of these pages. For page one, I will set background color as red. For page two, I will set the background color here. I will set background color as pink. Now for page three. I will set width as match parent and I will set background color as purple. For main.xml, let there be a linear with background color say lime. And after this, in logic area, here this you can see it contains these drawer view events text view 1, text view 2 and text view 3 so I will add these three things text view 1 on click, text view 2 on click and text view 3 on click now for each of these whenever these text view is clicked I will use this block close drawer so that when the user clicks text view 1 on the in the drawer layout it will close the drawer plus I will use intent for that I will add this intent component I and then I will use intent set screen and start activity intent intent I set screen page 1 now I will copy this blocks and paste it for text view 2 and here I will select page 2 activity and for text view 3 I will select page 3 activity that's all here and when floating action button is clicked here you can see this event floating action button so when this button is clicked I will simply toast a message 
that FAB is clicked or FAB clicked. Now let's check this. Okay, here you can see that when I click this home button, it displays a drawer layout and when I click on page 1, I go to page 1, if I click on page 2, I move to page 2 and if I click on page 3, I am taken to page 3 and when I click on this floating action button, it toasts a message FAB clicked. I hope this was useful for you. Thank you very much for watching this video.